Hey all, Hipper here. So uh, there happens to be a bug in Diablo 4 when you're playing local co-op multiplayer. And uh, I'll tell you in this video how you get around that bug. And uh, the problem is that uh, once you start a game with, for example, a character you already played, and it could be a character that you already leveled with another person, and then uh, the other person tries to join your game, it says none of your characters are eligible to join the current game. And uh, that was a big question mark for me, and I was thinking, why is that? So uh, first of all, I started to say, okay, well, I'll just create a new character then, right? Because uh, obviously, well, hopefully that should work. Now here we have a level 21 barbarian, and I'm trying to uh, like add a level one player in there. Now you're able, you're able to do that uh, usually, but not in this case here. And uh, it made me think, okay, perhaps this has something to do with the levels. Perhaps there's some sort of you know, maximum uh, distance in levels that you can have, but uh, it turns out that's not the case either. So because if you're experimenting with this, for example, if you pick a level 5 character and you try to join that game with a level 1 character, that's you can do that, it's not a problem. But uh, it has nothing to do with the levels of the characters, you can actually join characters with any level, which is a really good thing about Diablo 4. The problem here is the fact that uh, someone hasn't completed the prologue correctly. So now completing the prologue takes about an hour and uh, it's at the point Something where you like get to the first city, Kiovashat, and uh, you do the first quest I for Lorath here you. where you have to buy his weapon back from a merchant. Uh, Once you do that, uh, you get treated to a little cinematic here Sometimes and that's the point where you have collide. completed the prologue. Now there's also another problem here, because uh, you can start a local co-op game with two players and both of you play through the prologue and you know, everything should be fine, right? Uh, but, there is a bug, another bug in the game here, so uh, sometimes uh, the game doesn't register the second player's progress through the prologue and uh, it will consider that player as having not completed the prologue. So you could be playing for like 8 hours two players and then you take a break you play again next day and the player two won't be able to join just like in the beginning of this video here and that's because uh, the progress of player two has not been registered so uh, how to get around that well until uh, Blizzard actually fixes this bug here or these two bugs here which it really is uh, I suggest that if you want to play local co-op with another player uh, just like in the beta, really, I suggest that you both uh, play the prologue solo and then after that you join forces uh, once you've finished the prologue in a local co-op. I know it's a bit of a workaround, but uh, f I mean, that will guarantee that everything is going to be working smoothly after the prologue. Now to add to the confusion here as well, then if you don't have any characters who have completed the prologue, then when you try to join a local co-op game like I'm trying to do here, uh, you will just get this cryptic message that says that none of your characters are eligible to join the game. Which you know makes sense, but uh, like if you actually have at least one character that has completed the prologue, then you get a much like a, a much better warning really. So uh, we're trying again here with the same character, but this time we actually have one character that has com like successfully completed the prologue, and uh, then. What you'll get on the screen is different, as you can see here, because uh, my level 5 here has completed the prologue now, but uh, you can see that any character that has not completed the prologue cannot join the party. And that's it, that's the problem. But the thing is, you don't get this message if you don't have any characters that have actually completed the prologue. And like I said, you could have played to level, like, uh, or to act 3 or 4, even, whatever, and uh, the game just hasn't registered your uh, progress on player 2 in the prologue and still you won't be able to join. So that's it. So uh, as you can see you can easily join level 21 and level 5, it's not a problem. Uh, but you just have to make sure that each player or character in this case here has completed the prologue successfully. And the best way of doing that, like I said earlier in the video, play through the prologue like single player and then once you both finish the prologue you can take turns, for example, uh, then you join each other's games and play local co-op from then on. So I uh, hope this helped and see you out there.